Sport now and an athlete who wants to compete in next year's London Olympic Games has come up with a very novel way of raising the cash for his training. He's auctioning himself on eBay. James Ellington suffered four years of injuries but now says he's had his best season so far. Against the odds, he's managed to qualify for the Olympics but now desperately needs sponsorship money to pay for his training and accommodation. 26-year-old James, who's from South London, wants to raise £30,000 on eBay and he's pledged that in return he'll wear his new sponsor's branded kit. He joins me now. Well, James, some breaking news for you. I've just checked the eBay site and you've made it. You've got £30,000. Yeah. Um, How do I you mean, feel about that? It's great. It's great. We've still got 10 days left. Um, so, I mean, it can only get better. My uh, minimum reserve was £30,000. I mean, every little helps. I mean, I ain't going to complain if it goes up. How has it been not having sponsorship? How hard has it been? It's been very tough. Um, last year I had a very bad injury, I tore my hamstring. And um, it, was, it was so difficult coming back. It took seven, seven, eight weeks for me just to get my leg working again properly. And um, I think leading into this year, I knew that I, I would have to perform this year um, to put me in good stead for the Olympics next year. And um, I managed to pull it off, thankfully. But do you think that's incredible that in the midst of a recession, mm. people are, have given £30,000 of their own money to pay for the sponsorship? Yeah, I can't believe how many good people there, are, there is out there. I mean, so far the eBay comments, um, I've read all of them and they've, they've touched me a lot. Um, so many people, even without money, have offered to donate 10, even 10 to, to £100. And um, it, it's a really good thing. And why, was it the injuries that, that was why you missed out on the sponsorship in the first place? Yeah, um, last year, I think the, the sponsors tend to give contracts out two to three years prior to the Olympics. And uh, me being injured last year obviously didn't help my situation. So a lot of the sponsors overlooked me. So I've gone into this season with no sponsor. Um, managed to make the world champs, performed really well, but I'm still yet without a sponsor because hence they've given out two years ago. Do you have some sympathy though with Paul Radcliffe was saying that uh, throwing all this money at the Olympics opening ceremonies mm -hmm. was a bit frivolous. Do you think the likes of you should be getting some of that cash instead? I mean, I wouldn't turn it down if I was getting it. Um, but I'm just trying to aim to get to the Olympics. I mean, what do people do, obviously, with the money in terms of opening ceremony and spending it? I think it's, um, it's all good for our country anyway. Um, but yeah, there are some athletes out there that could do some of that money as well. So some of, you think it's a little bit of a waste, isn't it, to, to have those very lavish opening ceremonies? Um, I think it's part of the occasion. I think if you're going to host an Olympics, I think it's got to be special. I mean, it's, it's probably going to be years until London hold another Olympics. So I think we should make the most of it and enjoy it. Is there any sense, though, that British athletes aren't getting the sponsorship they should be because uh, we're not doing quite as well in athletics mm. as we might do? Um, saying that, I'd, say, I'd probably say athletics is one of our strongest sports, um, bar rowing and cycling. I mean, our athletes work really hard. We've got gold medal winners. Um, I, think it's, I think it's a lack of exposure for the, for the guys under the pin-up athletes. But there's a lot of athletes there on the brink who are ready to break through and they just need that extra push. So you're the next Usain Bolt? <laughs> I'd like to be. I'd like to be. Um, far off, but hopefully. With a fair wind. Yeah. James Ellington, thank you very much for joining cool, us. No problem.